Okay, we're going to evaluate this expression right here when x is equal to negative 2 and y is equal to 4. So be sure you just plug in these values into x and y accordingly. And when you plug in, be sure you open parentheses as well. So let's see. This is going to be 3 from here. And then the x is negative 2, right? So we put down negative 2 right here. And the y is what? 4. So we put down 4 right here. And then continue, we have the minus 5, and we open the parentheses, and then the 2, and then the x is negative 2. So we have 2 times negative 2. And then we have minus 3 times y. y is 4, right? So 3 times 4 like this, and close that parentheses. At the end, we still have this plus 20. Okay, so this is the setup. And now we just have to compute it. And you have to make sure you follow the order of operation carefully, right? So this is what we have to do. We are going to work out the inside of the parentheses first, right? As we can see, this is the big parentheses, and then we have two things to work out. Here, we have to multiply, and we also have to multiply, right? And let me just save some space. Let me just multiply it right here for you guys. 2 times negative 2 is negative 4, and let me bring down the minus, because I know 3 times 4 is 12 like this, and that's a minus in between. At the end, you can still work this out because it's still in the parentheses. Negative 4 minus 12 is negative 16, isn't it? And now, we did this already, and in the meantime, we can actually also work this out. This is how you can do it. Multiply the number first, and then do the sign. This is 3 times 2, which is 6. 6 times 4 is going to be 24, isn't it? And this is positive times negative is negative. Negative times positive is negative. So altogether, we have negative 24 for the first part. And now, let me bring down the minus 5, right? And this negative 16, it states in the big parentheses. So I will open the parentheses, and this is the negative 16 that we got earlier. Just put it in the parentheses. At the end, we still have the plus 20, okay? And now, we have to multiply this together, because the parentheses means to multiply. So here we have negative 24 states the same. This is negative times negative becomes positive, okay? And 5 times 16 is 80, right? And we can just continue by putting down a plus 20. And now what? It's just adding, so we just do it from left to right. So we just do this first. And we see negative 24 plus 80 is positive 56. So that's pretty much right here. And then you add a 20 after that. 56 plus 20, we have what? 76, and this right here will be the final answer, and that's it.